When you browse a website, the site's web server returns a bunch of code telling the browser what to display. Within this code is a link known as an ad tag. In its simplest form, the ad tag points to the publisher's ad server, which looks inside itself to decide what ad to show. The server then returns that ad to the browser for you to see, and the process ends. We will ignore the third-party buyer ad server call for now. But more likely, the publisher's ad server returns some code that points to what is called a supply-side platform, or SSP. The browser now calls the SSP, which then starts what is called an auction on its own side, reaching out to and requesting bids from a number of demand sources. These demand sources could be demand-side platforms, or DSP, and or ad networks. The DSPs and ad networks look within their own sets of buyer relationships to find which ad they want to show to the user and how much they want to pay for it. DSPs may run another auction on their side to decide the most relevant ad and bid. The DSPs and ad networks then submit a bid back to the SSP. The SSP executes an auction to find the highest paying ad and passes it back to the browser. The code passed back to the browser essentially functions as a redirect, and the browser now calls the winning DSP directly. The DSP sends back the code containing the ad it wants to show. The code is a redirect to the marketer's ad server, and the browser then calls the ad server. The ad server returns the actual creative, and the ad is shown.